with my base and I have this cover effects foundation this is in g40 and I have this color pop concealer in medium 28 you guys have already seen how I do my base so I'm not going to spend too much time I like to apply my foundation first and then I like to go in with my concealer on top just where my hyperpigmentation is I like to take this on an angle brush and just fill in my brows I want to go for a warm smoky eye look so I'm going to be using the pixie by Weili Huang eyeshadow palette first I'm going to take the color potato and I'm going to layer that all over my eyelids next I'm going to be taking a little bit of this break red color this is called beauties um, I'm going to be using that on the outer parts of my eye all right, to smoke out my eye, I'm going to be taking a different palette. I have this Little Too Faced Chocolate Bar palette. I'm gonna be taking the color Semi Sweet. Focus this color on the outer parts of your eye as well. And then just remember with every monolid makeup tutorial I do, I always um, remember to say this, but whenever you're blending, I like to push in to my eye socket and that's kind of where I end the blending of my eyeshadow. This just takes some practice, so make sure to kind of just play around with your eyes until you find something that you like. Going back to the Whaley palette, I'm going to be taking the color Beautis again, and I'm gonna be blending that on my lower lash line. Since this is more of a dramatic kind of night outlook, I'm gonna be taking this Schwing Black Liquid Eyeliner from The Balm. I'm going to attempt to make a wing because I haven't used this kind of applicator before, but I wanted to try it. I think I did a pretty good job. <laughs> Okay guys, I am going to do my lashes. I have my Lily Lashes from Kiss Lashes. I'm gonna be putting this on really quick and I will be right back. All right, for blush, I'm going to be using this Tarte blush. It's called Party. I think I got this for my birthday at Sephora. Okay guys, we're going to highlight and I'm very excited because I got this Artist Couture by Jackie Ina highlighter. It's a loose powder highlighter and it is in the shade, it's the rose gold shade. It is in La Peach. <laughs> I'm just going to take this and dust it onto my cheekbones and the tip of my nose. Wow, this highlighter is so pretty. I really like it and I just lightly would just dust it onto my brush and tap it off and you just really don't need that much and it just looks so nice i kind of want to make this into a glowy look so i think i'm just going to put some more highlighter on i'm seriously just putting this everywhere on my face okay i think this is the amount of glow that i wanted it glows a lot more in real life than it does on camera it's so pretty i'm going to go back to the take home the bronze bronzer by the bomb and i'm just going to warm up my face a little bit this is a very strong um, color, so you don't really have to take very much on your brush. All right, guys, I'm going to go for a nude. I have this Going Right Velvet Lip Tint from 3CE. Right. Now I am going to do my hair. I'm just gonna curl my hair, so I'm going to take a section, and I am borrowing Kat's curling iron because she said I could and um it's a little the barrel is a little smaller than the one that I have so I feel like this is going to just look better oh okay I curled my hair and burned my hand a couple times but this is the finished look I hope that you guys liked it um let me know what you think and I will see you next time bye